Ok, bah écoutez, c'est parti, hein. C'est parti, c'est parti. Let's go. Ok, everyone. I assume that you know why we're here, right? I've checked the perimeter. The coast is all clear. All right. Then it's time. It's time. Time to shop for the latest fashions at Chioria Boutique. Let's go. Huh. Uh, don't you think something sounds a little off about that line? Yeah, this is Chioria Boutique that we're talking about. I feel like we need something that sounds, I, I don't know, a little more extravagant, maybe? Mm. Well, we'll have yeah. to talk about it later. The lights have been turned on in the audience dire, je, je here. The rien. program is starting. Oh, um, hi. Bon là c'est les blabla habituels. Euh... Bienvenue sur le live. Euh, yeah. Yeah. As you can see, our show is sponsored by Chioria Boutique, one of the leading fashion houses in Fontaine. But before we go any further, ah oui, va, let's take a moment une annonce avec to watch Xiaomi, the version hein? 4.3 trailer. Camera operator, that can be a pretty okay. technical job. Are you really up to it? And, uh, oh. Wait, you put no thought into finding a good camera angle, and the characters oh, weren't in the shots. Hey, positions, everyone! <laughs> nice to meet you. I am Navia, the president, leader, commander in chief, oh, executive director, and oh, boss bien. of Spina di Rosula. Hey there! Yeah! Is that with a parapluie? Ah, no, it's a H! Oh, stylé. Et la hache. T'as une nette grosse. All right, cameras will start rolling as soon as the set is ready. Oh, Marina is really kicking things into gear as the director. Props and lighting set the scene. Actors can get their makeup done. Extras, oh. go over your positions. Camera ready. Get the proper board. Actors to your position. Lights, camera, action. Enough filling. Pay for the death of our mother! <laughs> what the fuck? You're just as naive as her. Did you really think two muskets would be enough to defeat me? What the fuck, Erika? Your crimes are evident! Oh, attends, c'est une lancière? Yeah. Ok, hein? Chevreux de lancière? Your weapon. Justice will prevail. Ok. Peut-être son ulti avec euh, le point, du coup? Not bad. The actors' emotions were all on point. Let's keep that take. We'll move on to the next scene. You uh, mean? You mean? Did you really oh. think you'd get away? Chevres. You can keep your mora, and bien. you can go to hell. <gasps> Excellent. That was beyond bien. mesmerizing. Let's. Make a film that'll make some serious waves in Fontaine. Uh, not the kind of waves that drown people. I mean, the good kind of waves. Putain, tout le monde détestait autant Yomiya qu'ils ont préféré la faire mourir à l'aide. <rire> Pauvre Yomiya. <rire> ok, ok. Mon premier code, attendez, je vous le note. Enfin, je le mets et je vous le note, du coup. C'est M. Putain mais pauvre Yoemiya, ils l'ont buté quoi. <rire> Les gens la détestaient à ce point là. Ok, okay c'est bon. C'est good, c'est good. Du coup si vous faites point estimation code dans le chat, euh, vous aurez le, le premier code primo du coup. à utiliser tout de suite si possible. Parce qu'ils sont disponibles moins de, euh, moins de 24 heures je crois. Chevreuse sous Yomiya, waouh, il a l'air cool ce film, Chevreuse. Un film <rire> C'est ça On des vagues à Fontaine, enfin, pas celles que... qui noient les gens, les bonnes vagues. Appuie Yomiya, rip Yomiya, on pourra plus jamais invoquer le perso. <rire> Welcome back to the version 4.3 special program, everyone. Terrible, terrible. I'm Sarah Miller Cruz, the voice of Lumine, and today I'm joined by. Hey everybody, I'm Brenna Larson, the voice of Navia. Okay, okay. Donc le jeu, ça va être par Lumine, Navia et Chevreuse. Enfin, les voice actors. Yay! 
Yay. Oh my gosh, I'm so <laughs> excited. This is the first time we've had you two on the special program. So excited. Yeah. It's so mm -hmm. great. <laughs> okay, so actually um, we have a tradition on the program where we all get to sing everyone a little song. Oh. Huh? <laughs> okay. okay, nice try. I've seen so the special programs before. You don't oh. want to sing I a song? Okay. Like I love song singing. I love singing. Okay, like we mentioned before, this program is sponsored by the Chioria Boutique. Mm. So while we're sharing content from version 4.3, okay, we also want to get some inspiration for shooting virtual for the team. Mm -hmm. We don't want to let our client down. Yeah, and, and speaking of new content, we can't have a new version without introducing some new characters. As you already okay, saw the trailer, version, Navia perso, and Chevreuse will be our new playable characters. Navia, Chevreuse, and the perso, yeah, we'll know that. I'm sure many of our viewers are already familiar with Navia. But I think there's a collab with Xiaomi and Kenshin. Conquest, but who is Chevreuse? Mm, who indeed? Um, <laughs> <laughs> other Fontaine characters have already mentioned Chevreuse before in their voice lines, but um, Chevreuse will finally be making an official appearance okay, in version 4.3. Okay, so apparently the Perseus Fontaine have already mentioned Chevreuse in their voice lines. I don't know if you're kidding. Oh, by the way, what do you think of letting one of our characters from the new version take the lead role in our commercial? Oh, well, I mean, mm. if we're shooting a video for Chioria Boutique, then I think Navia would be an obvious choice. After all, Navia's clothing was designed by Chiori herself. Wait, Erica, that was actually a really natural sounding product placement for <laughs> Chioria Boutique? You're, art, you're amazing at this! <laughs> I know, I know what bon, sounds like product placement, blah, blah, but Chiori really peu, was genre. the designer who created Navia's outfit. <laughs> um, next, <laughs> let's have a look at her fashion show. Ooh, and by fashion show, we mean her character showcase. Okay, donc, uh, I always say that blind optimism isn't showcase. the answer. Showcase. If you want Navia. a bright future, you have to okay, go well, out and see. Uh, Enfin, une hache parapluie, genre. En vrai, c'est stylé de ouf. Genre, ces animations ont un flow de ouf. Hein. Du coup, j'imagine euh, épée à deux mains. Géo et épée à deux mains. Apparemment, c'est pas un jeu qui se joue avec d'autres géos. Genre, c'est un jeu que tu peux jouer euh, sans géo. Sorry, can we take a moment to appreciate how perfectly Chiori customized Navia's clothes and accessories to reflect her personality? She clearly pays a lot of attention to the small details. Erica, I love how seriously you're taking the sponsorship. It's really great. While we're on this topic, though, Navia's parasol seems pretty interesting. On the outside, it looks like a delicate non, non, accessory pas pour, used to block out the sun, but on the inside, there's actually a secret firearm that can be used to ward off enemies at a moment's notice. Mais son elegant and fierce all at once. Bon. Just like Navia herself. <laughs> exactly. Even when it comes to her enemies, Navia is not the type to eschew basic etiquette. So she prefers to maintain okay, appropriate distance while in combat. While using her elemental skill, Navia opens her gunbrella and fires multiple rounds of shards that can pass through opponents, dealing geo damage upon a successful strike. Ooh. For a period of time after using her elemental skill, Navia's normal de charge de and charging attacks will deal increased damage and become okay. infused with the Okay, joue sur les cristallisations, donc faut faire un max de cristallisations. D'où le fait qu'il n'y a pas besoin de la jouer avec des géos du coup. En vrai c'est intéressant, ouais, de ouf. Il faudrait plutôt la jouer avec une team genre full multi-éléments. Pour augmenter de ouf ces dégâts. Navia will consume these charges after unleashing her elemental bonus, skill. Ouais, on her skill damage increases with the number of charges that she's accumulated. Oh, okay, okay, okay. So you were saying that Navia's okay. elemental skill becomes okay, more okay. powerful if she works together with mm -hmm. other characters in the party to trigger the crystallized reaction. Ouais, yes, ça, ça. exactly. <laughs> okay, great. <laughs> Navia's okay. elemental verse calls for the Rosula Dorata Salute, which unleashes a massive bombardment on the in front of her. Periodically dealing geo elemental damage. I should also mention that Navia will accumulate crystal shrapnel charges at certain intervals if she strikes enemies with the Rosula Dorata Salute. Ooh, now that salute is spectacular. That's awesome. I heard that the Spina Dorsula likes to perform firearm salutes before important negotiations. You know, as a way to celebrate future success. Don't misunderstand, you guys. It's not an intimidation tactic. It's a way to celebrate future success. Don't misunderstand, you guys. It's not an intimidation tactic at all. Oh, okay. 
Ouais, mais les cristaux, s'ils sont consommés, est-ce qu'ils te donnent quand même le shield Oui, 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 totalement. Pas Non, Ils utilisent les sacs. Parce que du coup, ça consomme le cristal, donc est-ce que tu as le, le bouclier quand même, même si tu consommes le cristal Ceci, si tu consommes le cristal, ça connaît le bouclier au cœur. Sinon, on peut dire qu'il y a le spina de Rosula. Ok, la quête de perso, du coup, je vais le bouc. Ok, ok, donc ouais. Alors peut-être ça peut être intéressant, là. Exactement. Some people even lost their lives during that disaster. I'm certain that those events weighed heavily on Navia, but she remained tough and committed to leading the Spina. Je suis contente, toutes mes quêtes sont faites, du coup, je suis prête là. Je suis ready pour la nouvelle quête de de Navia. Though the prophesized dangers are over, the town is probably still busy rebuilding everything, right? I bet Navia is going to be occupied with that for a long time. Oh, definitely. That's something that travelers will be able to see for themselves. Navia's story quest, the Rose of Multiflora chapter, will become available in version 4.3. The Spina will be working diligently to rebuild Poisson. Though repairing the houses will be straightforward, the emotional distress may be much more difficult to address. If you're curious about how Navia and her crew are going to proceed, then be sure to check it out. I'm so excited. Yeah, I'm looking forward to seeing what happens. Okay, so now that we've introduced Navia, it's time for Chevrolet to be in the spotlight. Oh, it's true. Okay, I know that since she's a newcomer, you probably can't wait to learn more about her. So let's get right into it. Okay. Um, hmm. How should I introduce her? Uh, first off, Chevrolet is the captain of the special security and surveillance patrol. Special security and surveillance patrol. Special security and surveillance patrol. Chevrolet is the captain of the Special Security and Surveillance Patrol, a Spontanean organization that handles all sorts of difficult cases and dangerous criminals. Ooh, she doesn't like to appear in public without good cause. So if you happen to run into her, it's likely that you're in some sort of trouble. But, but as long as you're a law-abiding citizen, there's no need to worry. Chevrolet is actually really easy to get along with outside of work. Fistos are just the best snack. Oh, they're so good to carry with you. Oh, plus I said that I wanted to eat them. Oh, it's nice, my perso. I like the churros. I want churros. I want the churros of chevreuse. Ah, it's going to appear as a bull. Who? Um, what? That was so fire. <laughs> and I am not just talking about the her skills. <laughs> oh my gosh, look at her idol animation. I non, love so that she loves snacks. Mm -hmm. That is so oh, awesome. She's a girl's girl. <laughs> and she gets it. Yeah. Yeah. She gets it. Oh oh God. God. <laughs> She's not exactly what you'd expect from the captain of the special patrol, though, right? I guess that's kind of true. I mean, Chevrolet's work as a captain can be really stressful. I mean, I can't blame the girl for indulging every once in a while to relieve some stress. She even adjusts her training regimen to make up for her snacking habits. In fact, she trains more than any other member of the special patrol. Her platoon really admires her for that. Wow, okay, she's got some willpower. That is awesome. She's really admirable. The Special Patrol prioritizes combat ability above all else. So the organization often attracts some eccentric personalities. Mm -hmm. yeah. <laughs> the Special Patrol <laughs> used to have problems with insubordination, but ever since Chevrolet took control, everyone has fallen into line. Which does not surprise me at all. <laughs> she commands respect and among her peers, and she's a formidable <laughs> fighter, and she leads <laughs> by example. Dans dans Though she calme. demands excellence from her platoon, ouais, she holds incroyable. herself to even higher Après, standards. Pas, pas, she always donne. tries to be an example for others to follow, whether it's investigating cases or in marksmanship practice. And it looks like a lot of her skills involve using a musket. She must be a pretty good shot. Avec des soucis dans son groupe au niveau de la hiérarchie, mais Chevrolet a remis les points sur le. Chevrolet and her musket are basically partners. Qui donc l'ancière Pierrot? She definitely has a firearm. The new Chevrolet uses her musket to fire at opponents during her elemental skill. For a period of time after unleashing her elemental skill, Chevrolet will continuously restore HP to the active character on the field. During her elemental burst, Chevrolet fires an explosive ah ouais, grenade with her coup, musket, okay, okay. which will split into secondary explosive shells upon impact. Haha, <laughs> impact. <laughs> wow. Well, shot. You continue. Restore PV. To your active shot. Ah, ça, ça sent le, ça sent le set. That's right. 
Le, le set maréchaux, c'est ça, non Lui, il se fait des shrapnels en tapant les ennemis. Par contre, il faut viser, genre. Ok, Attends, restaure HP sur leur actif caractère. Ah, attends, c'est Attends, restaure les PV De ton personnage, on point. Oh. Je dois aussi mentionner ce qui se passe si chaque personnage est composé de tous les pyro et électro caractères. Ok, mais c'est un peu plus compliqué. Si votre partie contient au moins un personnage de tout type, alors la réaction de l'overload va causer les pyro et électro résistances à diminuer. Ok, donc si tu as ça, ça fait okay. encore plus so de dégâts de euh, pyro et électro. Really ok, ok. Ça peut être marrant, genre de team. Mais j'ai aussi remarqué que Chevrus n'est pas seulement limité à un musket. Elle a aussi utilisé un polearm en combat. <laughs> ok. Honnêtement, si je serais un criminel, je me sentirais très nerveuse si elle venait après moi. Oui, bien sûr. La plupart des gens qui ont quelque chose à cacher ne veulent pas dévoiler leur vie. J'ai envie de le tester, je crois. Et peut-être qu'il le fait. En toute sérieuse, c'est pourquoi Chevrus se traîne si fort. Et l'extro pyro. Parce qu'en fait, cette réaction est un peu chiante parce que ça... Donc quand Chevrus est dans votre party, la stamina consumption est sprinting. Quand tu fais exploser le mob, il s'envole loin. Oh, j'ai aimé ça. These two new characters are great. Both of them would be great leads in our commercial. Stagger, ça dire quoi? Stagger. Mais ouais, la réaction est grave sympa, mais ça, 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 ça repousse les mobs, c'est un peu chiant. Ouais, sur les boss, par contre, ça peut être sympa, genre les. Quand ils prennent des recrues. Sur les boss, ça peut être sympa. Avoir avant. Ok, donc Navza, Navza et Ayaka, du coup. L'ambassade de soi, du coup. Ok, Raiden et Yoimiya, putain, mais... Toujours Yoimiya avec Raiden, hein. Et du coup, Chevreuse est sur... Oh merde Bon bah ça va invoquer sur Raiden, hein. Travelers can also look forward to two new artifact sets in version 4.3. Dawn's of days passed and nighttime whispers in the echoing woods. Okay, new, new set of artifacts. Okay, okay. Be sure to keep an eye on future announcements to learn more about them. Okay, okay. This seems like the perfect time for our first break. We've shared a ton of information so far, and I've had travelers give you some time to digest it all. You're right. Let's take a break while we take a look at the second group of redemption codes. The version 4.3 codes are the codes that are available. Let's take a break while we take a look at the second group of redemption codes. The version 4.3 special program is brought to you by Chioria Boutique, and will return shortly. Déteste vraiment Yoimiya. Mais c'est un truc de fou. À chaque fois, j'ai l'impression que Yoimiya, elle est avec Raiden, genre. Soit avant Raiden, soit après Raiden, soit en même temps, genre. C'est un truc de ouf. Après, vaut mieux qu'elle soit avec que... que pas avec, genre. Parce que si c'était avant ou après, tout le monde aurait skip. Alors que là, bah, elle a peut-être plus de chance, quoi, d'être invoquée, je sais pas. Ok, deuxième code. On estimation code dans le chat. Si vous voulez les codes, je vous rappelle qu'il faut les utiliser euh, dans les 24 heures qui arrivent. Sinon, euh, sinon, bah, euh, ce sera perdu. Je vais les mettre en épinglé. Voilà. Je les mets en épinglé, comme ça vous les aurez. Tac. Ok, nickel. C'est good, c'est good. En vrai, Yomiya vend pas, donc faut mettre quelqu'un de désiré. Bah ouais, c'est ça. We've thoroughly discussed our casting options for the Chioria Boutique commercial. Ok. Du coup, c'est quoi ça C'est du scotch What the fuck Do you have any ideas C'est un event, ça If we're making a commercial for Chioria Boutique, ouais, then how about we Nouvelle épée, qui est mort épée. Super, du père, un bon petit bol chez Miss Parky Magic Crystal. While the travelers have been able to see her store in the court of Fontaine, we'll finally get to meet her in person. Yes, I know. Travelers can also look forward to meeting Ayaka and Ayato in Fontaine. 
She already suggested that they should stop by, so here they are. So cool. Hey, hey, this this is actually the perfect time for a word from our sponsor. Imaginez un catalyseur. Inazuma born fashion icon Chiori. Chiori a boutique is your one-stop shop for the latest and most influential fashion in Fontaine. Ah, Chiori <laughs> boutique. <laughs> C'est ça qu'ils disent depuis tout à l'heure. Chiori is acquainted with the Kamisato siblings because she's also from Inazuma. She actually introduced Sibiria. Sayaka and Ayato Attends, to Xavier de... and recommended that they make the trip to Fontaine for the Fontanalia Film Festival. So exciting! Okay, viens pour le festival du film de Fontaine. Will you tell us more about the Fontanalia Film Festival? Oh, the Fontanalia Festival was established to commemorate the legendary Loch Ness. According to the myths, they went on a quest to search for the Oceanids and eventually welcomed the Hydro Archon Egeria to Fontaine. Mm -hmm. It's one of the most important festivals in Fontaine. Okay, like the et Furina sera le, le juge. Ah, so exciting! Ah non, elle connaît les frères, <laughs> Camisato. Ok, ok. Je me disais aussi, elle ressemble pas du tout, genre c'est bizarre. The Fontanalia Film Festival earlier this year. And during this time, the public may submit films for evaluation. The entry with the highest score will be given the Farina Award by the association. Well, we can see Farina working with Ayaka and the others here. So wait. Does this mean that there's a chance that Farina might win the Farina Award? <gasps> okay, the now Farina I'm award of oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Well, I'm sorry, but I'm gonna have to leave you in suspense. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. If travelers are curious <laughs> about what award. Ayaka and the others are doing in Fontaine, or how Farina fared, you'll just have to play the event when the new version becomes available. Hmm. So, we know that several friends from Inazuma will be in Fontaine for the Fontanalia Film Festival. But travelers have so much more to be excited about. Travelers will also have the opportunity to participate in a variety of activity booths during the festival. Each Donc, one okay. will have a different theme. Donc, a priori, c'est genre festival du film <laughs> so à Fontaine, cool. on va participer. The first activity booth is the Thousand Pace Introduction Arc Minute Sharp Shooting Zone. In this okay. activity, travelers will use the special oh là là, security and surveillance control simulation device to practice oh. targeting and shooting. Pardon, excusez-moi. Non, non, en fait, c'est trop bien. On peut shooter les ennemis. Ok, let's go. <laughs> Sniper. <laughs> ok, ok, j'ai un dieu, j'ai un dieu, j'ai un dieu. Ok, combat, vas-y, ça me plaît, ça me plaît. Special lighting effects to film a fight scene. Take advantage of the buffs faut, brought faut about by the special la, lighting effects to defeat ouais. an endless stream of opponents and obtain a higher score. So cool. Quand tu filmes, t'as plus de score, je sais pas quoi. Really ok, ça a l'air bizarre ça, mais bon, ça va, je peux also taper des ennemis, ça me va. It's all so atmospheric. Oh, for yeah. sure. But not everyone is enjoying the fun and games. Travelers will meet a contract employee at the third activity booth. Okay, ça c'est quoi She needs some help with her demanding client. During the activity Extreme what? Drive, travelers will help her test out stabilization mecha balls. What? C'est quoi ce truc? Attends, que j'ai plus de after those stabilization <laughs> mecha balls. Okay, I bet that contract employee can Faut relate. ramener les, les machins dans ta zone. <laughs> oh, il a l'air trop bien le mini jeu en vrai. Il va pousser des moutons dans le but. Ça mais il a l'air trop bien le mini jeu en vrai. Oh, pour le coup, je suis le, le mini jeu m'en intéresse un petit peu. Ça a l'air marrant. Which is perfect for quickly traversing to the other side of a stabilization. C'est d'avoir des pouvoirs aussi pour sauter un peu plus haut là en mode Ouais, c'est ça les petites boules et tout. Is possible within okay, the time ça a l'air marrant, hein. The more mecha balls that end up in your area, the more points you'll earn. The ça a l'air marrant. The booth is called Into the Frame. In this activity, travelers will get to shoot their own scenes by experimenting with different camera positions and narration techniques. What? Cool! We get to make a movie! J'ai l'impression, c'est vraiment en mode, ouais, full photo, film et tout. Ça va être que ça, genre. But this seems more professional. Wait, maybe this can be the inspiration for our commercial. Oh. Ooh. Now that I think about it, a Fontanian man went to Inazuma to shoot a film. I guess international travel can be a source of artistic inspiration. That must have also been true in Chiori's case, since she opened Chioria's boutique in Fontaine. Ooh, je, that je could be a strong theme for our contre. commercial. Actually, quoi, non? Ayaka and Ayato aren't the only Inazumans traveling abroad in version 4.3. Kuki Shinobu just arrived in the rien compris au truc là. On fait des yeah. mini films, what the fuck? Oh yeah, yeah, il est le retour game. comme d'habitude à Ratakito. Dans moi un him. event par mage. Wow. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Armor Beetle. Ah mais c'est un truc de fou. Ito, il est dans tous les events. Genre chaque mage a un event Ito. C'est un truc de fou. 
And there was also a Beetle Battle event in version 3.4, right? Tu sais, un film de montage de scénario, ok. On verra ce que ça donnera. Mm. Yep. C'est le clown de Genshin, ouais. Mais du coup, c'est quoi Ça va être des, des escarabées encore Travelers will have to discover their identity during the event. Ah. Oh, let's go Ça c'est trop bien. J'ai trop kiffé le combat de scarabée, C'est trop bien. Hein. Un des meilleurs mini jeux qu'ils ont fait. Travelers can now also instruct Onikawa to defend against pouvoir against electro bullet and jet stream attacks. Genre, genre de bouclier Oh, c'est trop bien. Je vais affronter des scarabées. Master them. And you'll be ready to tackle the oh ouais, okay, ultimate trial of the strong. Mais tu veux déjà envoyer, mais là, je sais pas, ça a l'air plus euh, du zéro. <rire> Travelers can look forward to encountering an old friend in the Fontainian oh, countryside. Le retour des fées. Olmen came to Fontaine and he brought his treasure map and euh, treasure-seeking Seely along with assez. him. Yay! <rire> Our mini Seely friend is C'est pour ceux qui n'avaient pas la fée encore. <rire> so cute. Travelers can help restore oh, the ceiling's vitality by absorbing energy from the locations <laughs> that are marked on Olmen's treasure map. In return, the Sealy will guide us to the locations of buried treasure. Go After collecting ouais, ancient iron coins during this event, you can exchange them for various rewards, including mini Sealy in your preferred quoi. color. Okay, okay. Ooh. Okay, so in the event proper, the Sealy will guide us to the locations of buried treasure map. In return, the Sealy will guide us to the locations of buried treasure map. Okay, so in the event preview, it looks like some of the treasures located oh, la violette, la rose. when I first arrived in Fontaine, I discovered that Seely couldn't follow me underwater. Is this brillance, treasure seeking Seely different? Uh, that is a very oh, well, observant of you. Oh, thank you, thank you. <laughs> Après, je les parce que le son suit, in this iteration of the Lost Riches event, a new mini Seely named Brilliance will be available. This new mini Seely can travel underwater. Le son des Seely me <laughs> Treasure isn't the only thing that you'll discover in Fontaine's countryside. Dance you might also come across oh a mysterious domain guarded event, by a event unique swordmaster who searches for the meaning of battle. Event During the dance of resolute will, travelers will get the chance to participate in combat challenges. Each challenge stage will contain two rounds. Travelers must select their party compositions before the challenge starts. One of your chosen Faire characters combats. must be used in both rounds, but no other character can be repeated. Oh, okay. Mm -hmm. Ah, okay, genre tu choisis ta team, mais tu peux pas répéter, tu peux pas reprendre les mêmes persos. Ok, je crois qu'on a déjà eu un événement comme ça. Defeating opponents while heightened verve is active will grant you more points. Aussi, hein. combat, moi, another old friend is returning in version 4.3. That's right. MDF. Yeah. 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 And if Leven is around, then that must mean we'll have a chance Leven to trade a bunch of flemme. items for primo gems again. Ooh. Ooh. Ça c'est gratuit. Ça c'est gratuit. Okay, so it looks like Leven is the only old friend we'll be able to trade with in version 4.3. Ça c'est vraiment Leven gratuit. Genre c'est vraiment le truc. Non, les mecs avec ces crocs là. Ok, les crocs. After this update, travelers will have the opportunity to okay, challenge characters uh, okay. around Fontaine. Ooh. A new Fontaine themed table customization will also be available. Ah, I'm so excited to see players challenge the melodies. I know, so Moi, excited. Moi, j'ai vu la carte de Signora, mais je joue pas au TCG. Travelers the addition of several new cards, including six new character cards. Plus, en vrai, j'ai l'impression que les gens qui jouent au TCG, ils mangent bien là ces derniers temps. Ah, Signora. Signora. But that's not all. The Forge Realm's Temper Event will also be making a reappearance, and there will be an update to the heated battle mode. Be on the lookout for future announcements. There's TCG content to look forward to outside the game as well. The Genius Invitation TCG Asia Invitational will officially begin in January 2024. Mm-hmm. Travelers can look forward to some friendly competition between 16 of the top TCG players all across Asia. Ah, ils ont un tournoi de TCG en Asie Ok. Putain, mais vraiment, ils mangent Gucci, les, les mecs du TCG. Hein. Oh my gosh, this is also avec le chat, là. Mm. <laughs> Well, hang on to that feeling, because we're taking a short break to look at the next group of redemption codes. We'll be back to sharing more exciting information about version 4.3 in oh, just a moment. Long, hein. Il est plus long que mon avenir. Hein. Ok, ça doit être le dernier code du coup. Je vous le note. Alors, 8B. 
Q Monsieur M M Et voilà. Dernier code est dispo. Je vous le remets dans le chat. Voilà. Nickel. Nickel, nickel. Appelez. C'est classique ça pour un TCG je sais pas, j'ai l'impression ils mettent, ils s'y mettent à fond sur le TCG et tout. Ils ont des tournois et tout, euh, plein de nouvelles mages, des nouvelles cartes, des nouvelles fonctionnalités. Enfin, ils se mettent bien. Par contre, ils, ils vont parler quand même des, des nouvelles fonctionnalités là, dès qu'ils ont parlé dans le dev blog. Hein. We've introduced pas, hein. a lot of content and we've gotten a ton of inspiration for our commercial. Ils n'ont pas du tout parlé des, des améliorations au jeu. Ah voilà, système d'optimisation, je me disais aussi. Artefact en, interface optimisation, optimisation des, des challenges, des quêtes, des expéditions. Ah, okay, ça c'est cool, ça c'est très très cool. Genre va y avoir plein d'optimisation pour, euh, pour le jeu et tout. Euh. Genre déjà pour les artefacts. Euh... To see what artifact sets active players have been choosing for that character recently. That's cool. Mm -hmm. In addition, an automatic okay, locking function has been added. Perso, Now, when filtering artifacts in your inventory, you can lock the artifacts that fit your filter specifications in batches. With the automatic locking function, newly acquired artifacts that fit your locking criteria will automatically be locked when added to your inventory. Oh, that's awesome. Je pas compris à quoi ça sert, ça par contre. Je peux voir les sets utilisés pour chaque personne or follow the recommended settings summarized for active player data. Since hmm. it may take some time to collect des the necessary des statistics, de new artifact sets will not feature recommended locking settings immediately. Okay. Yes. <laughs> of course, if you can lock Je artifacts pas, in batches, ça, ça, you can unlock them in batches as well. Travelers can look forward to both of those features in the new update. That's not all though. What? Travelers will be able to sort artifacts by three different Ah, c'est quand tu fais les donjons, Plus, dès qu'il y a un truc dégâts crit qui tombe, c'est autolock. OK. Oh, il n'y a plus besoin de d'appuyer sur OK pour faire la suite. Oh, let's go, on peut spammer. Let's go. On va plus mettre 40 ans à monter nos artefacts. Hein. The project team is okay, always working putain. hard to address your survey feedback. So, travelers should look forward ça, to further cool, hein. artifact related optimizations in future versions. Improvements wow, après, to ouais. equipping artifacts and other artifact related optimizations are all in the works. Ooh. In addition, the project ça, team coup, has made adjustments pour, to provide euh, smoother level, ascension hein. and enhancement experiences for travelers. When you level up a character, enhance an artifact, et as plus la, la or enhance a image, weapon, you no longer have to click okay, so many pop up windows. Oh, that's awesome! As a new mm -hmm. player using a few one and two star materials to level artifacts, c'est cool en vrai. C'est un petit truc, mais c'est sympa en vrai. with pop up windows appearing. Mm. Totally. This new optimization significantly reduces the amount of pop up windows that we have to click. Ça va, ça, so ça va réduire un petit peu le temps. Ouais, toujours pas le preset, the mais bon. The next optimization, optimization has made it easier to repeat domain challenges. Ah, ça c'est trop cool genre. Ça c'est vraiment très très cool pour le farming genre. Surtout avec les les joueurs. Chapter 2 Act 4 In the Depths An Unexpected Reunion takes place in the underground mines of the Chasm. In the past, travelers had to complete the world quests, Chasm Spelunkers and the Heavenly Stones Debris before being able to proceed to the Archon Quest. In this update, travelers no longer need to complete those two quests. Okay, ça c'est bien pour les nouveaux joueurs. Travelers can speak directly to the miner who issued the commission to unlock the teleport. Vous pouvez la quête du gouffre pour euh, faire la suite. Pour aller euh... and automatically trigger the next steps of the Archon quest. Oh, pour faire la suite de la, quête, yeah. de la quête, vous n'avez pas besoin de faire euh, faire la quête de euh, les quêtes bah, de, 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 du gouffre et tout. Hein. 
overlaps players to access the archive. Ça c'est sympa pour les débutants, ouais. Ceux qui commencent le jeu. Très très cool. Yes, definitely. For sure. Also, one click expeditions will be available starting in Claim Hall. Oh yeah 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 yeah. Claim Hall. Ces expeditions. Ma vie. Ma vie ma vie ma vie. Cook. Non. Claim Hall. Oh là là. Pour le cook. Pour le cooking aussi. Pour le forgeron aussi. Non. Oh yeah 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 yeah. For example. Les optimizations have been made to enemy tracking with the adventure handbook. Non, vrai, ils ont fait plein plein de, de, de bon jeux. Hein. In addition, when performing mystic operations, de 12, ouais, travelers will now be able to add artifacts and badges. Pour les claims, ça va faire plaisir. There's a lot to look forward to. C'est pas un truc de fou non plus, mais ça fait plaisir. Future announcements for more information. Okay, moving on from optimizations, a new Fontaine-style realm layout will be added to the Serenity Pot. Simply purchase the corresponding items from Tubby to unlock it. Oh, ah, it looks like an aquarium. Oh, c'est trop beau. <laughs> know, right? <laughs> Travelers attends, can attends, use attends, attends. ocean current to travel between the islands in this lake. No. Some islands even have ponds the travelers can use to keep fish. It oh. looks like a cool underwater cave. Okay, je vais faire, je vais, je vais, je vais décorer ma ma théière. And they'll be even prettier once the travelers have the chance to make them their own. C'est trop beau. C'est sous l'eau. I'm so excited to see what everyone's going to come up with. Je vous jure, je vais décorer. Actually, my friends' teapots. You just want to copy their designs, don't you? C'est trop beau. Je vais passer ma vie dedans. Me? I knew it. I have another piece of super exciting news to share with everyone. Okay, I know, right? The annual Genshin Impact online concert, Melodies of an Endless Journey, is coming soon! Yay! Ok, Genshin Concert, le 22 décembre, c'est quel jour? C'est un vendredi, c'est à quelle heure? Attends, j'ai même pas eu le temps de voir, c'est quoi? Aïe 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 aïe... Wait... Qu'est-ce qui se passe? Je recommence le jeu. Ah non, c'est le concert. Waouh Non, c'est online. Ce concert online, il parlait. Mmh. Oh, c'est... Ah, j'ai des frissons J'ai besoin des frissons quand j'entends cette musique, genre... Je suis nostalgique. Ça me rappelle le, le début, genre... Début de Genshin, putain, ça fait déjà trois ans. Oh les petits phoques et tout. Je sais pas c'était quoi alors. J'ai vu euh, 6 UTC, euh, UTC moins 6. La taille du fond vert. The 2023 Genshin concert held in Shanghai last September will also be online soon. Eight UTC minus six. That's what I thought. Whoa! So we have two online concerts to look forward to. Yep. Further details will be announced across Genshin Impact's official social media accounts. So be on the lookout for more information. At the end of version 4.3, travelers can also look forward to the release of the fourth Genshin Impact character OST album, Stellar Moments Volume Four. The album will feature 26 character songs created by the Hoyo Mix team. Wait, we are finally getting out Hatham and Wander's OSTs. And Farina's song too. Her song "All the World's a Stage" has already been getting a ton of love. Oh, that's awesome. Oh, c'est la meilleure annonce du live. C'est la meilleure annonce du live. C'est la meilleure annonce du live, putain. Okay, well, that's all the new information you have to share about the update. So, I guess that means it's time for the version 4.3 special program to come to a close. Aww. Oh yeah, je suis trop hype par les musiques. <rire> Est-ce que c'est grave d'être plus hype par les musiques que par les nouveaux personnages Actually, <rire> You're right. The special program was a pretty good commercial. I'm certainly not going to forget the name Chioria Boutique after this. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. <rire> Oh my God. God. We really did cover a lot of important information today. For sure. The most important part is our final word from our sponsor, Chioria Boutique. <laughs> I'm just kidding. What the hell? 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 I just wanted to let everyone know that I'm so excited to be a part of Genshin Impact, and I cannot wait for all of you to meet Shubras. Ah, totally. 
-hmm, I feel mm -hmm. exactly the same. Can't wait to see more Navia in her fighting action. And <laughs> yeah. also, can't wait for little swimming sealies. Yes, they are so cute. So oh cute. And I think the new mini games are really fun, especially the one where we get to make like a little mm -hmm. movie. Yes. Je crois que c'était la boutique du PNJ, bah ça a l'air d'être un vrai truc. Ils arrêtent pas de dire qu'on saute par Shuri boutique, mais on sait même pas c'est quoi comme genre de boutique. Bon, ils ont dû le dire vite fait, mais j'ai pas trop capté ce qu'ils font. I hope that everyone's looking forward to experiencing all this exciting new content for themselves. Be sure to check it out when the update goes live. Yeah, yeah. C'est pas une vraie boutique. Okay, bye. Right, bye. Guys. <laughs> See you later. Bye, bye. bye. Oh. Excuse me. Zongli BG. Sang Ching Du Museum. Ah, c'est un musée euh, en Chine. Oh, il est trop si sa tenue. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Trop, trop stylé. Bon bah très bien. Ah le skin est incroyable mais on l'aura jamais. <rire> on ne l'aura jamais. Terrible, terrible. Ok ok bah très bien.